Hey everybody, what's going on? Cameron Steele here from the Best in the Desert Parker 425 live on Fishgistics. Uh, we're getting ready to start the unlimited classes. Of course, everybody knows the number one qualifier is Andy McMillan, number 31. And right now I'm standing just outside the infield. I'll give you a nice pan of where we are. And uh, here you can see this is the part of the race course, right where they uh, have the infield jump, so to speak. They're going to race right by, right in front of us here. And you can see that a pretty solid crowd has uh, gathered here. The officials have pushed everybody back. And uh, welcome to Fishgistics coverage. This is Cameron Steele. Well, I got visual on the first truck, which is going to be Andy McMillan. He's got a helicopter over him right now. And uh, they're going to be starting one car every minute so you're gonna have to listen to a lot of me and we'll update what we're doing here's andy off the jump airs it out and you'll be able to see him here in just a second let's listen to the motor sing Racing and Parker. And uh, you can see that there's a pretty solid dust coming this way. People are going to start shifting probably. I'll probably shift as well. And uh, only 60 seconds between trucks. Here comes the next truck. Actually, I take that back. Next buggy. This will be Harley Lett, your number two qualifier. And on the gas, off the jump. I'm not sure if you guys can see it, how well you can see that. I can't see well on my screen. Harley second on the road, coming to this first turn. Conditions report for you guys. It is about 78 to 80 degrees as far as I would guess. And as you can see, the wind isn't exactly blowing. If I had to guess, I'd say somewhere in the two to four mile an hour range. And it's blowing from south to north. And uh... Howdy everybody, Cameron Steele, driver of the number 16 Monster Energy Bulletproof Diesel FIDAC. Method Race Wheels, Baja Designs, Fox Shocks, Lucas Oil Truck. And I'm here on location for Fishgistics. And someone's airing it out down below. This is your third starter, Justin Lofton, if I'm not mistaken. Making her sing on the binders. It's through and clear. We're going to stay with you guys for about 20 minutes or so, maybe more. So please share this. For those of you that were paying attention yesterday, for every share we get, Fish hops on and gives me another $10. So uh, whether you believe that or not, you should be sharing because we're making the effort to give you some off-road content here. Big shout out to Best in the Desert. They put together a great race. I'm not sure the results of the morning race, but a lot of stoked people having fun as it looks like it's going to be, here he comes around the corner. Someone told me Robbie wasn't racing, but this looks like Rob. You can hear the crowd. Number 77, Robbie Gordon. Not sure, uh, I don't know, to me it didn't sound quite as peppy coming out of that corner as normal. I don't know, uh, there was rumors that uh, he had an engine problem in qualifying. I can't confirm that, but that was a rumor. So maybe he had an engine change, or maybe he's taking it easy, or maybe he detuned a little bit. 
but uh, not quite the same explosion out of the corner that we're used to seeing from uh, old Rob. Welcome everybody to Fishgistics. And here we go, BJ Baldwin. As you guys know, BJ out of Las Vegas. Your fifth qualifier, a lot of big hitters right up front. To me, it really looked like Andy was, was pushing, Harley was pushing, Lofton was pushing. But then uh, Robbie and BJ didn't look like they were going on super crazy speed. I take it back, it might be 85 degrees out here. It's warm. And got some helis in the air. Lots of people, man. It's packed around here. Here comes the next truck. And I'll try to get a visual on who that is. I don't have the starting list in front of me. Got a little squirrel dog there off the side. Coming uphill. Look at this, on the gas. He's carrying more speed than anybody there. Oh yeah, Dale Dondell, man. As fast as anybody to that first turn, or that turn in front of us, I should say. And uh, out of it, Dale Dondell in the brand new truck. <laughs> 